Hello dear friends and followers. In this video I'm going to show you how to assemble a DIY digital temperature controller kit. Although I did all the soldering correctly, but at the end I messed it up by connecting power in the wrong place. Anyway, I hope you will not make the same mistake as I did. As you can see here, there are no markings which terminal should be power input and how much the power should be. Sadly I couldn't even find instruction guide on the IC station website. To save your time, I have already soldered everything and here is how the finished product looks like. As you can see there are too many resistors in it, and you might get mixed up very easily. To solve this problem, just remember there are 7 470 ohm resistors and 5 4.7k ohm resistors, and you will find them like this. And the rest is too easy, I hope you won't need any help for that. Ok, now let's see the functions. This button is for switching on and off and set the temperature. To turn it on just push and hold for a second, and to turn it off to the same thing. And these two buttons are for up and down. This is the temperature sensor, which is quite responsive as you can see in the test. When this LED turns on, that means that the temperature has gone up the above set value. And it will output 5 volts from this terminal, which can be used to turn on a relay or something. And here is the last part which I made a mistake of. Well, that's because I couldn't find anything which tells me where I should connect the power, and what voltage it should be. Although it doesn't work properly, but let's play with it anyway. It should show the temperature now, but unfortunately it only shows minus 1. As you can see that because the set value gone below the temperature, which was minus 1, so it turned on the LED. That's all for this video, I hope you liked it. If you did, then please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks a lot for watching.